What's up? We are on now. One in the melanin. And I am the blackest co-host. Big win. What's up, niggas? Let's start this sh- up. Sugar honey iced tea. First, before he stop with All the right. yellow jacket, I, this is my first podcast. Um, tip is overly sticky. Um, areolas are extremely tight. I've done pass gas ten times as I walk through the door. This is I've never I've never dr- done nothing like this before. He gonna gave me some smart water, but the brain Shout ain't. Out smart water. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Shout out smart water. <laughs> oh God. Okay. <laughs> Let's see how this go. You know. And one thing about me, I like to talk a lot. <coughs> Let's start talking. How's your day going? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good, bro. How you been, dog? How's everything with you, man? Uh, What's popping? I just really been having a kink for playing with belly button sweat. Uh, okay. Sounds about right. You know? Yeah. It's been a little gloomy, but I think that's because the Scorpios are coming out of from hell. You know? Okay. But other than that. You know, I'm chilling. Word. You know, having yeah. a good day. You know, not too much. Just got a fresh cut. Word, you feel word. me? Hey, yo, shout out to yo. How much you pay for haircuts, yo? Like forty. I miss when they used to be twenty. I swear, yo. To God. Yo, 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 yo. When yo. they used to be twenty dollars, I don't know what happened. Don't piss me off, bro. We had a whole conversation about this on one of our episodes, and we posted a reel about it. Like, yo, why the hell niggas are charging three hundred dollars for a haircut? That's what I'm saying. These these, these landscape prices. I'm like, <laughs> nigga, what the. A hundred dollars, but I seen people pay fifty, sixty for a haircut. Like know. honestly, live within your means, right? Like I get it. Like it I mean, if you got bread, go for it. I mean, it, it is what it is. Not but even, it's like, no, no. That's a lot. You that's know? that's that's robbery. People came at us in the comments on that video, bro. We had like eighty barbers in the comments. That's what, I made a video. I made a video. I had barbers from all L.A., New York, trying to tell me, "Oh uh, well, it is a recession." I don't give no. I'm not trying to hear that. <laughs> I'm not trying to hear that. Nobody's trying to pay you, you 60 bucks for a haircut that don't last two weeks. At least have some ladies at the door for me or yeah. something. You know what I'm saying? Watch that. And, bruh, and it's gone. You take a shower, that one's gone. It's gone. <laughs> all the enhancement, all like, the chalk. It's gone. But the thing is, I know y'all be, y'all be good. Don't get me wrong. Y'all are good barbers. I've seen nice haircuts from what I've got And I've me, I sweat a lot. So, so, and I'm active. Exactly. So, mind me, I'm, I'm paying you 80 bucks, okay? Mm-hmm. I'm sweating. You know what I'm saying? Now my head, my hairline gone. Boom. Within, within 24 hours. Just like that. Where's, where's the rest of my 60 bucks working? I didn't get no shorties at the club. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I didn't even get a twerk on session. What's going on? Man. You still got the fade, though. You just still, still got the, <laughs> yeah. I, still, I mean, I still got the fade. The fade with no hair? The fade with no hairline, bro? It's crazy. I'm looking like, you know what I'm saying? 2008 Bill Cosby. It's not, it's not cool. <laughs> but it is what it is, though. It is what it is. It I is understand they is. got bills to pay. Yeah, yeah. Stuff like that. Nah, shout out to all the, all the upcoming barbers here, bro. Y'all make your money, bro. But yeah, nobody hating on your stuff. Don't don't DM me saying you want to cut and it's a hundred dollars. I'm gonna look at you crazy. <laughs> this is I feel like this is how we grew up, low key, huh? I would say yeah, but like I remember they used to be twenty dollars. Yeah, bro. Twenty dollars. Yeah. I think they maybe maybe they uh up the price because of the enhancements cost a lot. Facts. All that other stuff. Facts. Yeah. They have different things that they yeah. add to. I'm sure to make the service but more Jesus or whatever. Lord. This is a lot, bro. <laughs> I'm cool out that. Jamar, how much you pay for your haircuts, yo? Free. Well, you get hair? What? I thought you, ain't you bald? What's going on? Yeah. Oh, wait, let me see. Okay, he got some. Yeah. He got some. <laughs> to just, your trajectory when you was looking down, I ain't even see all that. Okay. Uh, I'd pay 50 bucks for a haircut. It's not too bad. I'm fine with it. Okay. Is he like an an excellent barber? Fresh cut, I get older dudes. They're like, yo, we get your haircut. Hey, that's when you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's when you. I was telling you, when you get a cut and you got the old little, the little G.I. Joe looking ones, the yeah. bodybuilders, yo, where you get your cut at? That's when you know your cut fight. I've done had it a couple times. You take that You take that target run? <laughs> hey, the target run every time. That target run. Anytime right, you get a cut, you got to go target. Right around like four to six. <laughs> what? I'm talking about. That's, that's rush Cantaloupes. Out. Cantaloupes. Watermelon. Man. Ooh. And they don't, man, boy. <laughs> they be in there for no reason. Go to the little. Some targets got the ultra beauty section. Oh. I go out to the gym. 
Oh my god. You go out to the gym? I go out to the gym, I swear to god, I got my TikTok on. Ooh, it's cold outside. I got you know, my Yo my bro. Chest be oh, I know oh, hey. Man. You're a menace, yo. <laughs> Jamar's a menace. Shut up on the same time. You want the same time. Oh, it's terrible, bro. Yo. But I was saying, would you go bald though? No, I mean, if my if my hairline's receding like that bad, bro, I'm not going I can't save it no more. There's definitely a point of no return. I feel like point. I couldn't go bald if I don't got no like facial. No, that's true. That is true. If you don't got a face, if you don't got facial, if you don't got like a good beard, or at least the, the mustache goatee combo, then you're gonna look kind of off. Yeah. No. Well, ah, the rock bald though. You don't got no face right? But his head's strong and shit. <laughs> and he's swole. And he's swole. So you can't really say nothing because mm. like. He literally like, elbow you. Yeah. Like, Our like, superintendent had no eyebrows, no facial hair. He was straight bald. No eyebrows? No eyebrows. What do you got, alopecia? Maybe. I don't know. No okay. eyebrows, no mustache, uh, goatee, no hair. It's a straight bald. Face is naked. Okay. So turtle. All right. <laughs> so turtle. Turtle. Yeah. Fair enough. Now, I couldn't. I mean, I'm not going to keep trying to line it up if it's too far back. I can't. Yeah. I feel like you're going to look crazy at that Cause point. Because people were saying, why did Tupac go bald? Because he had hair. He did have hair. But he just... Went bald. Hey, he made it work, though. Some people make it work. Because I'm, I'm thinking about it, like, when I hit 26, probably 27. Yeah. I'm thinking, I don't know. I don't know what my head looks like. You can go to Turkey. Because I'm flat in the back. You know what I'm saying? My head flat. Yeah. yeah. Would you go to Turkey? What's Turkey? The hair li- they have, like, hairlines. Oh! Because, yeah. It's this YouTuber I watch where I see him do it, but it's like, I don't know. I feel like it's a waste of money. Because I seen his, I don't think his hair really grew back. Mm. It's like, his shit, like. I like the the Tory the Tory Lanez joint. But see, I want the Tory Lanez supplement. Mm. You know, I would do that. Mm. It's only be only because though, I seen Tory's the results. Yeah. And it's like his like big hair. Like he was down there bald. And yeah. He came back. Right now. Like if mine was like right here, at least I get more chicks. <laughs> you think so? It's just I that my forehead fine, large. I think that's fine though. I, I I feel like the way your forehead is, it's not like it's not as. Big what y'all as think? Thing. Nah. My forehead's a little too big. You think so? Mine's like, I'm going to keep my hat on now because I'm kind of insecure. But no! Like, like, no! I'm joking. Because I was going to come in. I don't got to cut right now. See, if mine's was like that, that'd Bro, be... Bro, yours is like mine, though. No. Bro, I have a, I have a, I have a fairly large forehead. I don't have a cut right now, so my hair's kind of crazy. I have my hat on. Mm. But it's all right. There's nothing too crazy. Okay. But see, so. you got this, though, so it... A little bit, a little bit. You get bit. some points. It doesn't fill in here, though. This is my thing. I want to fill in... I don't know how to get this to fill in. Because it goes... It comes down. It's genetics, though. That it's is always, hey, everything's genetics. Brush it. Brush it. Just keep brushing it. I heard if you just shave it, every time you get a haircut, yeah, shave it. Brush it. I'm you scared. Train it like you got hair. Yeah, mm. basically. I I've done tried. I was I was digging the church route for years. Where I could never grow a beard. Because my dad, he Jamaican, but he got like beady bead, like a beady bead hair, and I'm I don't want that. Nah, I feel so you, I feel if I you. genetically gonna get that, I'm shaving it every time. I don't want no beady bead. You struggle beard, yeah, yeah, nah, no. Cause see, like right now, guys, y'all can see the waves, but like give it like two and a half weeks, the coils start curling up, and That's then look, right. I look like them, 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 them West African kids, <laughs> Southern African now river type, yeah, yeah. It is what it is. Fair enough, fair Four enough. 4C, can't control it. Yeah. Scapulations start going over the place, can't yeah. But it is what it is though. <laughs> so is. so DMV native, correct? Yeah, yeah. I've been here, been here for all my life. <laughs> I'm tired of this place. I'm ready to escape. I feel like, like, like living here is like the devil hand just keep grabbing my neck. But you know, I, I ain't gonna lie. As long as I've been here, I'm I'm really blessed that I've been staying so. Relevant throughout these years, I ain't gonna lie. Thank you, cause man, thank God. the hate here is crazy. But yeah, you know, I can imagine so. Cause it's a, it's a tight knit like community. Yeah, right? and everybody know everybody, so it's like, hey, shout it talking in this shout it man. I, you, you, hey, bro, man, probably already clapped the cheek, but it is what it is, you know. And then the hate, like the hate. Oh my God, man. Oh Jesus Christ. That's a, that's when I first thing. started. Yeah. Man, them, man, they made me pass gas so much time. Like, I was just being myself. I remember people, I got, this one person said a hate comment on Twitter. This one, Twitter, when the DMV was like, booming. This was probably like my high school year or something. Like, I just got out of high school or something. I was dancing. And I got hate for it. I said, yeah. No, they, it is what it is. No, nah, it's hard. I can imagine so. I feel like that's why a lot of, like, our DMV, like rappers, for example, haven't like blown up, blown yeah. up. Yeah. The most we have is like Shy and like Wale, but it's like. But I, hey, any of them, I tell, hey, I see why they get up out of here when they get the A. That's a fact. That's a fact. I, that's a fact. I got a little, 
a little sick coming up, but I'm gonna keep it low key. Yeah, yeah. But I'm I'm getting out of here soon. I, uh, uh, can't, can't, <laughs> I don't I blame you. Bro. Get up out of here. Nah, I'm too used to this. Cool place, place though. Cool place. Y'all should try the mumbo sauce with the wings. Mumbo. Yeah. Shout out to mumbo fries. sauce, bro. We got to try probably the best curry outs in the nation. Where? Yeah. Where? <laughs> yeah. But other than that, nah. Mm-mm. Cool place though. It's a cool yeah. place. You know, met some cool people here. You know. Like you, you know what I'm saying? Appreciate you, boss. Cool Appreciate people. you, boss. That's some cool people. Yeah. We growing. We growing little by little. Yeah. What was that by a second? What do you think was like your, the video that took you off? It really helped you blow up? Where you're just like, damn, okay, people are rocking with this one? I bet. I was So I got like three. Okay. Early stages was me and my brothers dancing. Yeah. Like doing like the, like real heavy mosh pit dancing moves. Okay. Like with the loudspeaker to the side and we just dancing to like, I guess, trippy rib. Where? BNB, uh music, just a bunch of just mosh pit type pushing them brothers like mosh, you know the white men with elbowing each other. Yeah, 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 all that crazy. I would say that me crying, that was like, that was like my first viral video. Mm. And then after that, a bunch of people was like emailing me, sending me their songs, saying, "Hey man, I, I seen you two thousand just to cry." I'm like, "Oh, <laughs> wait, what? Whoa, you gonna send me two K to just to cry? cry? Cause it, cause it would go on world star like, like mm. that." I'm like, oh. That's like when Worldstar was popping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Worldstar was popping. Yeah. And so I would do that, crying. What else? I would say just like talking about relatable stuff, but in a funny way. Yeah, yeah. 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 So those those three things was, was really pushed me. And probably like impersonations. Where? No, yeah, yeah. yeah no, nah, I know you're like, a big accent guy. Like, bro. I love it. I love it. I love it. I got like, shoot, how many characters I got? Give us, like a, give us eight. a little. Give probably, us... probably like eight. I have like eight. eight like a Jamaican, Where? white guy, Where? emo. Uh, young boy, uh, <laughs> African guy, uh, shoot, that's five? That's five right there. Anime. I oh. know you're big UK. I oh, the UK, right. yeah. yeah. Don't, don't the, UK the UK guy. Yeah. Bro, I have a lot, bro. Yo, it's so you, crazy. you mind giving about. me a showcase of a bit of these things? Okay, bet, bet, bet. Break it down for me, As he talk, I'm going to keep doing Hey, but look those, man. I say as though, man. I really, a lot of people like to talk about my limitations, and I feel as though, man, I've been trying to stop the violence. But you know, you know what I mean? Hey, man, say. It be what it is, you know what I mean? And I don't, I don't speak about it, but you know, actions speak louder than words. I just let it be what it is, you know what I mean? Hey, but bro, if you know, things can be partially, you know, what it is, and then it, it, takes, it takes you there, you know? Some people like you for what you are, some people don't, you know? And it's pretty cheeky. Oh, Lord! <laughs> Great giggly moogly! <laughs> But you know it is what it is, bro. You know you just gotta keep hustling, keep doing what you're doing. And if you can find your foxy babes, maybe she'll give you some sulky sucky. You know. I believe you no. Know, I but I I say no good, you hear me? Hey, I got like a lot. I got a I lot. I love it. I love it. I love it. I got it. a lot. That's, what, I'm That's gonna do fine. That. But you know, my brother, I I say you know, I I love the you know the women. They love my black heart and they don't. They want to suck me. <laughs> they, they, when I come in the section, the function, they like, oh my dad, daddy, I love you. And you know, it is what it is, my friend. I love it. it. <laughs> I got a bunch. <laughs> nah, that's fine, that's fine. And I just do it. <laughs> and I learned it, right, like watching Eddie Murphy. Yeah. Uh, Martin. Jim Carrey. Yes. A lot, of, a lot of black folks, not, I don't want to say a lot of black folks, but some people sleep on Jim. Jim, man. One of the most expressive the car- people out like, there, yeah. Impulsive. I'm talking about the faces. That's where I get, like, that was another thing, too, like, how it really got me up there. My faces, the faces I would make, mm-hmm. I got that from Jim, just like a little, little egg ish and just watching Jim. I'm like, it just make me laugh. I'm like, this dude is not, like, human. Yeah, and no. then I watched a lot of Ed, Ed, and Eddie, and mm. you know Ed and Eddie, they're so. <laughs> yeah. It ain't a regular cartoon. Yeah, that's a fact. Boondocks, man. Boondocks, greatest. Most of that greatest yeah. black television show, like ever. I don't know when they gonna do the reboot. Yeah, that's one of my favorite cartoons, what, bro. What, what, when they gonna do the reboot? I don't know, <laughs> man. Oh, but hold yeah. on, hold on, hold on. Uh, Sai's calling me. Go ahead. Yo. Yo. Yo, why you didn't make it? Okay. <laughs> Are you eating your scabs? Why you didn't make it? Hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Pause, like. <laughs> He's playing with his scabs. Nah, bro, you know, yo, even when I'm laying down, bro, I got on some essentials, bro. I'm, I'm always dripped out no matter what. Always dripped out. <laughs> he got the fear of God on in the bed, bro. Bro, no matter what, you will never catch me slacking, bro. Come on. Like, okay. Hey, hey, if y'all didn't notice already, he's not here. He's not feeling well right now, bro. Mm-hmm. Sensei, I some love, bro. 
He's not feeling well right now. What you got, the monkey? Bro, I ain't gonna lie. Yo, I'm not eating any more sushi for the rest of my life. Bro. Sushi? That's, that's all I can say, man. Like, Ooh, nah, that's not it. <laughs> he just ate a cat's yo, elbow. I to call in show some love, Ooh. man. Yo, yo, big one, I'm a fan, bro. So like, love, gang, love. I, I, love. Wish, I could, wish I could genuinely meet you, bro, but I guess... Our timing wasn't now, but in the future, I know it will be. For sure, for yeah, sure. Yeah, because you missed out, man. I done passed gas 13 times. Yeah, he, this whole place <laughs> boofs so Stinks. bad right now. It boofs. Stinks. Funky bond, y'all smells. Ridiculous. Yeah. Yo, I ain't gonna lie, but I texted me saying you deserve getting sick. So, like, him smelling that gas, bro? Appreciate it, bro. That's my revenge right Yeah, that's, that's basically my warm welcome since you ain't here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ephesus on the warm, though. <laughs> they hot, they hot. They, they hot. hot, they spicy, bro. Drunk crazy. <laughs> yeah. Well, right now, like, right now, because, like, you know, man's over here laying down, kind of, like, going through it. I'm thinking of some, like, deep things, bro. Uh -huh. So I wanted to ask you, right, if you could know the absolute truth to one question, what would you ask? And I, I want something, like, genuine answer, bro. Come on. Wait, so you, if, I, if I can tell you, if I could tell you the truth to one question? What you would say? If you could know the absolute truth to one question. What would you ask? Like what? Like if you can know anything that you've always wanted to know, what would you ask? Ooh, that's interesting. It's really two yeah, though. Be... It really two though, twin. <laughs> All right. Yo, what's up? What's up? I would say the absolute truth. What are people's first thoughts when they meet me? Okay. Like they're, you know, because some like immediate or like thought type. they're immediate thought or like, what are people saying when I'm not around? One or either that, or what is my, if I could, what's my actual purpose? One of the one of those, mm. one of those. Mm. Like, what do people say when I'm not around? And what's my actual purpose? What's my actual purpose? Like when I came out, my mom was Gucci. What is my actual birth? Because, you know, I wanted to play in the NFL. I wanted to stiff arm a couple folks, tackle a couple folks, but hey, comedy. You know what I'm saying? You Maybe never know. putting a smile on people's face. I think that's what it is. Yeah. You never know. Generally speaking, you never know. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Because this could, like, who know how long, y'all? Yeah. What if it's music? What if it's, you know, who? I don't know. Because I used to think that because I, I was doing comedy for a while, and then out of nowhere, the music was doing better than the comedy. So I'm like, okay, maybe mm -hmm. I'm just a entertainer. Maybe I'm just a musician. Maybe the comedy guy did that at first. Just, just get my name out there. And then, hey, maybe you should just be a rapper. So it, it, that's what I'm saying. What is my actual purpose? Jack of all trades. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. Jack of all trades. Yeah. yeah. That's, his, that's his answer, boss. Oh, man, that's what's up, bro. That's a good, that's a good answer, bro. I would say, yeah, I would say those two or. Something about a pride, something about a pride about a girl or something like. Mm -hmm. Is she lying? I'm saying. Oh. <laughs> all right, boss. All right, Yo, man, be safe, brother. Feel better, dog. All right. Hey, we oh, got yeah. smart water here, we bro. Drink smart water right now. Hey, hey Sasha has a smart water. Yeah. I don't know what's in it, but it keeps making me gassy. I don't know. <laughs> could have been that that damn cr crunchy beef taco head. That's yeah. also something. Yeah, could be that. All right, yo, I'm going to tap in with you. I'll call you after, all right? Hey, yo, real quick. Yeah, yeah. Yo, I miss the noise of life. Always take a moment to appreciate the silent strength of anyone who's going through whatever yeah. we, don't, we don't even know about. Yeah. Facts, facts, facts. Always nah, he, appreciate people. He told always appreciate yourself. Even if they're making the, the loudest noise, even if they're Preach. silent people, always take the time to appreciate each other. Always take the time to appreciate Preach. people, strangers, no matter what. Boom. We never know what it's going through. We never know their purpose in Preach. existence. So let's be one of those li uh, shining lights for them. Yeah, for okay. sure. With that being said, hey, drop another gas for him, bro. <laughs> you heard that? I just pooed it. He just pooed it. <laughs> yeah, I just pooed it. <laughs> all right, so I'm going to call you after, all right? Nah, Love, bro. Right. You say, well, like a son. My G. Yeah. <laughs> See, he was talking a lot. He was just preaching because yeah. I had DMs. I've had DMs before when people were like, yo, dude, I really feel like you're sad half the time. And I'm like, uh, do you you don't know me. Really? Because I see like content creating is like my therapy. Uh -huh. So... I post damn damn it every day on Instagram. Yeah. If I don't post probably longer than a week, two weeks, I'm probably going through a lot, you know? Mm -hmm. But other than that, if I'm posting, I'm chilling. You chilling? I'm chilling. I'm having a good time. 
maybe a little, maybe, maybe, maybe had a rough day, maybe, maybe stubbed my toe. You know what I'm saying? Maybe something like that, maybe. Got to pay a bill. You know, every, every, paying bills really do make you frustrated. What? Yeah, don't. After, <laughs> don't well, hey, me. best advice to any anybody my age or younger. Don't leave your mama house till you're ready. Yes, please. Till you are ready. If she's letting you, your dad letting you stay there, stay. 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 <laughs> please you know, save your money, bro. Jesus Christ. It's like, turn your neck. Bill. Bill. I'm like, nah, son. <laughs> but hey. It is what it is life. It is what it's it life. is. It is what it is. It's life. Yo, uh, you heard Omega just got shut down. Who was that? You never used Omega? Oh! Omegle. 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 Omega. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. pronunciation is not pronunciation. It's Omegle. Omegle. Yeah. Omegle. I just heard that. Because I was on stream, and they was like, yo, dude, get on Omegle, dog. Get on Omegle. And I was like, nah, they be showing they wieners out there. Bro. They cold cut sandwiches. I ain't trying to. <laughs> nah. I ain't even trying to get up on there, shorty. Nah. Bro, growing up, I remember growing up, I used to go on with my cousins all the time. Just, just talk to random people, bro. Mm -hmm. It's. They don't even wait <laughs> until the camera turns off. I'm talking about soon as you switch the camera. I'm yeah. like, whoa, shorty. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> But no, nah, Omegle, that used to be me and my bra my me and my brother's like favorite platform at yeah. the time. Because I think all those like going live and talking to people. Mm -hmm. I just always like talking. Yeah. It may be my ADHD. But I just love talking. I really can't shut up. Yeah. You know? That's probably why my son bad is But hey, <laughs> I just Amigo was definitely something. It's it's it hurt when I seen it was done. Yeah, and I just saw that recently. Saeed just got me hip. I was yeah. like, yo, bro. I seen it on Twitter, and I seen the little message. It was like a little message with the little tombstones. Like, mm. Yeah, I mean, that joint's been there forever, too. Yeah, but I know the, um, I know the like, the Jeffrey Dahmers and the yeah. ghettos are That's what they're, they're, they're saying. Hurting. They're That's hurting. what they're saying. That's yeah. why. But it is what it is. Ruin it for everybody. Yeah. Were you a big, uh, Mecca? were you big, y'all use Kick? You use Kick growing up? K-I-K? Yeah. No, I didn't get a phone till like junior year of high school. Really? My dad's African. I mean, my dad's Jamaican. Mm. Mom's from DC. Mm. She wasn't strict, but for me, like my, she wasn't strict with my brothers, but me since I'm her firstborn. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, she was. Mm -mm. So yeah, once I got a phone, that's how I feel like my purpose was probably the content. Cause soon as I got my phone, mm -hmm. cause I got a, my friend gave me an iPod. That was just to get you know. The shoddy's number. Yeah. <laughs> you know, learn about Vine. I think as soon as I got as soon as I got that uh, that iPod from my friend, Vine had just ended and they was telling me, bro, bro, if you was on Vine, bro, oh my lord. You would blow up. Yeah. And then I had first got my phone and that first year of me having my phone, I went viral. Word. I'm talking about that twenty seventeen to twenty twenty, that whole man. That was probably, man, those were some good years. <laughs> some good years. I'm talking about didn't pay a bill, didn't have to worry about no bill. Facts. No worries in the world, man. I'm talking about barely had any money and was still. Happy. You know? That's a fact. And I was like, I, it's kind of crazy, though. When you, you're, some of your happiest times when you don't got no money. That's what I'm saying. Because you find other things to do. Like, yeah, you just find, yeah. It's kind of crazy. You, out, you have but now, though, since I'm much older, I'd rather have money. That's facts. But yeah, that's yeah. I mean, it's responsibilities now. Yeah. You're old now. You got stuff to pay bills, exactly. Bills, so boy. you can't run away from those. You can't run away <laughs> from bills, and you can't run away from the IRS. They oh. will get you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I don't know if it may be tomorrow, maybe next, but ten years from now, they will get you. Don't play those games. Do not play against pay the IRS, taxes. bro. They will get you quick. Don't play with your life like they've that. They've been me. <laughs> they on their way. <laughs> so pay them taxes, but nah, yeah. That's what I would say, like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Getting my first phone was definitely something. Because it was new. I wasn't, I barely, because I was the kid that, like, you know, go to school, class clown, mm -hmm. go on the bus, come home, be outside till the lights come on, play the game. That was it. I was never really just always on my phone. Yeah. Stuff like that. But once I got it, oh, my God. Lord, mercy. <laughs> That's all that happened. Like booties bro. everywhere. <laughs> You said you're a big, uh, you're a big, uh, big Riz guy. I mean, I feel group. like, I feel like, look, 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 look. Oh, I might have started some. <laughs> oh man, you Break started, it dog. Me. All right, I would say. How's big one Riz up people, bro? Like when it comes to girls, I like the girls that don't know me. Okay. If that makes now that I'm well known, okay. but before I just be, I would just be funny, and man, they 
Like I like, cause like you're talking about risk. I like I li- I like this terminology called reverse riskology. Like it's reverse riskology or something like basically reverse psychology. Yes. Where you don't have to really compliment a show. You don't really have to do too much. You just be you, all and right. then the girl does all of it. Interesting. If you just tell her, "Hey, I just want to be friends," but you may you may throw a flirt here and there. You may pull up to her with a nice haircut. You know, get his little sparks. Now she's like, "Oh my god." That's really how I was, though. Fair I would enough. say that's like my, like that works for me the best, or just being naturally funny. Yeah, yeah. I was Same just thing. at the Smoothie King, and this shawty from Mississippi that had a kid at 12 oh. trying to tell me, everybody, G. Nah. <laughs> Maybe down in <laughs> Tuscaloosa, Mississippi, down by the bayou. Uh, black men don't cheat. Black men don't cheat. <laughs> I say it like this Black men don't cheat. The only way a black man cheat, if the girl do something that she's not supposed to do, or what, we don't cheat. I feel like I'll leave before I cheat. That's what I'm saying. I feel like you shouldn't be in a relationship if you're going to cheat. If you're not happy, just leave. Just leave. That's you know a fact. Like, There's no point. It's your fault that he cheated on you, if you ever got cheated on. you. I'm talking to this camera. I'm talking to you. <laughs> if anybody ever cheated on you, it's your fault. I don't, I never cheated. They was like, she was saying, everybody cheats. I was like. That doesn't make sense. I was like, what's her form of cheating? Me, cheating is it's two forms. Mm-hmm. Once another man dingling go inside the cooch, that's, uh, yeah, that's, that's, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's clear as day, yeah. Clear as day, like, what are you doing? Yeah. I've seen guys go right back to the girl. I'm like, are you mentally nah, not stable? Nah, I'm cool, I'm cool, and I'm then cool. And another form is, like, little signs of entertainment. Yeah. You know? No entertainment. I hate that little, he's just my brother. Okay. Yeah, I can go play house over there. What are you doing, huh? Because I feel like as a guy, you can see if another guy's trying to get at your girl. Type. Basically, yeah. yeah. And you, as a masculine man. You know the you sign. Not, yeah. You know the sign. And already being a man, I hate when a shorty be like, oh, my God, he's just my cut. No. no. He ain't no cut. He ain't no bro. Shorty, you not dumb. You know, you know when he's trying to get in them drawers? That'd be, man, be like mad, mad oblivious, right? Maybe like so oblivious. I didn't know how you ain't know. Nah, he knew when I was in them DMs. Mother, mm, let me let me keep my profanity. <laughs> Get some water, bro. Jesus, I'm down in this water like it's some malt liquor. Oh, we, Jesus, we got some little water bottles back here too. If you want more water, mm-hmm. let me got the little joints. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but yeah, I hate oblivious women. Jesus Christ! Don't be clueless. You know Don't the deal, man. You know what's going on. Dude. Yeah, come on. <laughs> He try to put his fishing rod in your net. Come on now. Like, what? Ladies and gentlemen, don't get in a relationship if you know you're not going to be loyal. There's no need for Fellas, it. don't get in a relationship if you ain't got no money on That also true. If you ain't got no money on, you ain't ambitious, and you ain't got your priorities together. Boom. Don't get in a relationship. Please, save your time, save your money, and save your sanity. Please. Not Sandy, either. big on Sandy, boy. Exactly. Because you, whoever you with are going to want, more, like, any time you eat, she going to want eat. Wherever you go, she want to eat. You know what I'm saying? So it's always it's double. So you got to make sure your, your money on there. Please. Yeah. Then your sanity. Yeah, Lord. don't. <laughs> don't stress yourself out, honestly. You don't need the unnecessary stress. So you're yeah. too young. If you're not ready for it, don't do it, bro. Yeah. Especially if other people are, like, around you. I know you may feel like you want to get into it because, like, everybody else got their joy. Yeah. And some people be like, Dude, I, I I really just like to be in a relationship because like I don't like the lonely vibe. Some people can't. You shut the. <laughs> shut up! Like I don't, I really don't understand that. Like how, dude? I just I, I can't stand being lonely. Me, I'm an Aquarius, so mm. we're big on just me time. Yeah, I can be to myself. I tell, I tell mind. my girl like, hey, let me grind, let me, let me. You know what I'm saying? And then once, cause I'm clingy too. But let me work, and then after I get off of that, then let me be in your skin. Yeah. Then I feel like if she too clingy, then let me. Hey, let me, let me have my me time. Let me get my toes in the tub with some soap. Listen to some Bob Marley reggaeton. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm Sip a little bit of margarita. You know what I'm saying? Bubbly. You know what I'm saying? Don't be all. No. <laughs> I like me time. I'm big on it. No, I mean as you should. I feel like everyone deserves to have a little bit of their own time, just yeah. so they can just sort of. Uh, refresh, yeah. Sort of chill out, have some space. Not to say you gotta like 
it's just like you don't got to be clingy to be in a relationship yeah you nothing do. wrong with being like having those moments yeah be with your girl that's your that's what you have your girl for but it's like but sometimes they'll maintain think your like, space everybody would you love would you still love me if i was a bookworm like, like <laughs> we're in a relationship we ain't like like calm down hey anything other than yes is a problem bro. yeah like, don't say <laughs> yo so we got a i got a rapid fire question round for you I rapid have like fire. Yes, so I got about like we'll put thirty seconds on the clock. Oh, I have a bunch oh, of questions I'll ask you. This isn't good on my answer. Mind. However you want to answer. Okay. okay. All right. I'll get the timer ready for you. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. This random question. You be all right? I'm sure okay. you can handle it. I hope. All right. Ready. I'll put it at thirty-five so I can get to the question. Ready. Set. Go. Go. Name an onomatopoeia. Onomatopoeia. <laughs> Five. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what the, what the fuck is on the monitor. It's like a sound effect. A sound Boom! effect. Okay. What's your favorite store? Target. Target. All right. What were you afraid of as a child? Uh, uh, women. <laughs> what's your What's the ugliest accent? Hello, Harry Potter. <laughs> Harry. Who's your favorite comedian? Oh. Uh, damn, it's hard. Martin. All right. Eddie. Is what is water wet? Is water black? Is water wet? Uh. Yes! <laughs> yes! Matter of fact, just because I'm going to add 30 more seconds on the clock. Okay, bet. This Boom. Is, this is, I like this. We're back in. No arms or no legs? No, no, no arms. All right. Celebrity crush? Uh, Ruby Rose. Favorite DMV artist? What's his name? What's his name? What's... Damn, you got a lot, though. Cutiful. Cutiful. So it's cutiful. Can you say M without touching your lips together? M. 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 Without M. touching. M. <laughs> no, I can't. I can't. Oh, wait. What does NASA stand for? Nash na 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 National Systems. National Solar System. <laughs> <laughs> what does it stand for? National. National. Solar National Aeronautics. I forget. Aero Hold on. I'm going I'm to search for that. NASA. Jesus. It was. um. It's uh 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 uh. uh Man, that played with the brain, Lord. <laughs> Lord it's National me. Aeronautics and Space Administration. Yeah, I was not getting that. <laughs> Why do I look like Ned Flanders? I don't know uh, that. Well, appreciate you for participating. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> that was funny. All right, so um, what are you working on now, just as a creator? <sighs> what you got going on, player? Right now, I'm streaming. So if you guys want to like, you know, follow that, I would say uh. Follow that. It's the real big win with three ends. Check out his stream. Check out his stream on Twitch, y'all. What else? Um, YouTube heavy. Been on that real heavy. Like, you know, I've, I've always had a YouTube channel, but like making videos, editing my own videos and posting them, seeing the reactions and the comments. YouTube. Uh, what else? You know, everybody going to say real estate. No, I ain't doing this. <laughs> uh, what else? Music. I love making music, man. Check out I his stuff, it. bro. It's like another sign. It's like another, like, I make my music, I can just, everything zones out. You know, and then when you make a fire song, you just got that bright smile on your face after hearing it and recording it. Oh, my God. I've been networking more this year. Mm. Before, I never, I don't even like people. <laughs> um, but I love you guys. You know, I love you guys that's watching. We love y'all. I love y'all. We love y'all. We're just in Houston. Them boys out there work. Really? Man, when I tell you they work. They work out there. I love it. You know, <laughs> definitely a different feel from here. Yeah. Not too many people work. I mean, they work, but not work, like, content-wise. I, yeah, I feel like it's hard to I feel like it's hard to interact with a lot of people from the DMV. Boy, you ain't never lie, boy. Like, I swear to God. Because we reach out to a lot of people, ain't right? Ain't nobody but it's not a lot of in people. the DMV that do the same thing I do. I feel like, I mean, they mm. do, but not to, like, I say, like, I ain't going to even lie. Like, I don't want to have a big head, but, like. I'm one. I feel like you one of the few. I'm one of the few. You one of the few. DMV still in the DMV that that like is so huge, and it's only because that DMV. It's never like I tell I tell rappers I've like I've collabed with rappers like Big Flock. So I've it's a big made flock. music with him. I tell them they they gotta eventually leave that DMV. I feel like there's a, there's a cap. It's a cap that we can only go. Yeah. Because I used to make DMV type content, and it got me to where a few followers, and once I got that, I stopped doing it. I, you're like, you got to stop. There's we only so much you can do at that point. Be, 
DMV. You only gonna be known as a DMV comedian. Mm. I go to Houston, Florida. Oh my God, you're the TikTok guy. Oh my God, you're the. That's what you supposed to be. You ain't supposed to stand at DMV and oh you be killed like you oh Jala you make them oh yeah. no man, that's <laughs> I hate it. I don't like it because you know I can talk just like y'all, yeah. but I don't talk like that. Yeah, you gotta no man, don't gotta, that don't limit yourself. Don't like, limit yourself. Really try to expand. Be versatile as you can. That's what I. That's one of my biggest things. Be as versatile. Learn Facts. something every day if you can. Yeah. You know, don't be lazy. I'm late. I'm probably one of the laziest, hardworking people I know. I know it sounds crazy, mm-hmm. but I'm the laziest, hardworking people I know. If it's something that I really want to do and I like it, I'm gonna do it. Boom. I'm gonna sweat bullets, tears, blood. <laughs> but if it's something I really don't really care about, well, I'm lazy about it. But uh, yeah, just it's just the DMV as a whole got a threshold, and you yeah, if you really want to yeah. like get millions of followers, you gotta you gotta change up. You gotta change up. Yeah, expand because yeah, this people is... always be like. Department motor beat no no, <laughs> and we got a lot of talent here. I ain't gonna yes, think like we that don't. is true. No, don't even don't even get it wrong, bro. DMV has a Man. lot of talent, but it sucks that we never just speaking as like a general, like in a yeah. general space. Man, like, I went down we Atlanta. Man, that. them boys out there like to network. Like when I'm when I was telling you about Houston, they yeah. like to network, and they don't have no shame about who has the most followers, who yeah. has the most clout. Who's funny? Who's not? Who don't got talent? But they was out there working. I'm talking about they had a camera there. It looked like this. Yeah. But it's just, yeah. yeah. DMV got talent. They got, we got some real, I'm talking about we got ballers. Even Fact. besides the content, we got some real ballers Fact. though. Like sports. Like oh, yeah. No, we got Hoopers. We got, hey, shout out to uh, shout out to Bones Highland. Man. He's killing it right now. We Markel Fultz, Markel, man. Facts. Who else? I'm Chase Young. Hey, Javante Davis from B- from DMV, from Baltimore. Yeah, Baltimore, man. Uh, who else? What's that boy? Blake Corm. Mm. He was he played for Michigan. Mm-hmm. Man, we got a lot of talent. We got especially people. on the sports side. I ain't can't even lie. Yeah, we like that, man. man we, we like, like that. that. I just wish we could love each other. I want us all to help each other and just out. flourish that upon each other and just push it. Hey, it's kind of we over. would be we up there with New York for real, like mm. we up there with Atlanta, man. It's just like people gotta even when it comes to like clothing. Mm. Or man, man, we got it, we got it, yeah, we got it. And, you and, just gotta stop that hate, man. Yeah, and that's kind of what we're doing here now. We collaborating, you no know, different creators, yeah, different from the creator. DMV. You know what I'm saying? Now y'all know I got like a lot of following, all that, but I'm I'm not gonna I I'm never the type to be like if it ain't beneficial. <laughs> I'm never that type of dude. I've, I've, oh, anybody that knows me personally, I've helped people that ain't have no name. I help people that. What? How can I say? I've helped people that never helped me. I've always been that type of way, and it's always was genuine. Mm-hmm. I'm a genuine guy. Anybody you can ask anybody. He definitely I'm a is. Guy. Definitely I'm never is. just like a greedy, a greedy little gremlin. No. Mm-hmm. Nah. Nah, I commend you on that because yeah. it's like we need more people like that for sure. Because yeah. with that being the case, I feel like that's how we would grow so yeah. much more. But to wrap things up, and you kind of touched on it a little bit while we were talking here. If you had a message to your younger self or just like the young, the youth mm. out there or whatever, what would you advise them? I know you said a bit of it here now, but like especially message, to your younger self. Message to my younger self. Yeah. Because that's something we really do like to promote here, especially towards the end of our videos. It's mm. like give off like how do you want – you know, how would you help these people that are on the come up like you or just going through it or whatever the case is? How can you help them get out of that spot or help them improve their lives, et cetera? Mm-hmm. What would you think you would say? Aside from the IRS stuff, because that's like, that's that's common knowledge. So. <laughs> yeah. Do not F with the IRS, please. Common sense. <laughs> they will hunt you down. When they will call the CIA. You will be sleeping in here. Helicopters flying over your <laughs> head. I'm, not gonna... make, I'm not making this up. Fast. But look, I would say message to my younger self. Have some patience, man. It can take five years, three years. It can take a day. Don't compare yourself to them. Have some patience. You got it, buddy. You got some talent in you. You're, 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 you're way much better at doing what you do than him. You're quick, you're quick at it. You're quick at it. You're light on your feet, but you, you know, you let your frustration and your patience take over. Be very patient. Message to my younger self. 
There we go. I still struggle with the patience, though. No, you're, you're not alone, bro. We want I things hate, to happen so quick. I'm telling yeah, you, bro. I just like that immediate, even when I be at the gym. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Especially when I started going to the gym and I wasn't getting that six pack or I wasn't getting that pack because abs hurt. That's a fact. <laughs> I'm like, my stomach hurts where my abs. And then message to the youth, for real. Message to the youth. Keep going. I can't even lie to you. Consistency, consistency is is the key. Yes. I'm As cliche about, as it may sound for, for a fact, consistency. It's so cliche, but listen, I'll, I'll look at my old videos and be like, ew. Yeah. But as I kept making videos, I'm like, man, you're a funny nigga. <laughs> like you just gotta, and then then I would say like, when you what's that what's that word? Seeing your self growth, probably one of the best feelings. Progression is beautiful, bro. Like I would look at my old videos, I'm like, ew, what was I doing? Yeah. And then now look at my video, I'm like, oh my god. I'm looking at my like old ways how I used to make money. Looking at my new ways, oh my god, that's you. Shh. So yeah, message to the youth, keep going. It's cliche, but you gotta keep going. I get messages every day. Man, your videos get me out of a depressed state, man. I'm not gonna lie, I was not feeling well today and I watched your video. That's just like, how could like how could I not keep doing what I'm doing? That's a fact. That's why I tell you, I keep going. Keep that must going. be a nice feeling. Bro. It's, been, it's an amazing feeling. And that's what we're working towards here, just having that platform. One of the biggest things that me and Sayu try to like express with this uh, platform is just to sort of have people, like a place for people to escape. Mm. Pull up here. I know you're stressed out. Yeah. Come take a break. Listen to our podcast. Talk. Vibe with us. Listen to other people we have on. Yeah. Geek around. Like, have fun. Like, yeah. just to, like, because there's so much going on, bro. Mm. People be stressed about all types of different things, bro, yeah. in their own individual lives. So being able to have that outlet, whether it's through a, a video they see on Instagram, mm. uh, the podcast they see on YouTube, on um, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, whatever, bro. Yeah. Anything that you can use to sort of, like, have that escape, that makes me feel peace of mind, bro. Yeah. Honestly, just to provide for people, how yeah. people feel better about themselves. Yeah, it make it just a good feeling. Good That's a feeling. fact. Yeah. Good Thank you so much for being out here with us. Honestly, bro. Did I let you talk? I feel like I ain't let you talk. No, I talk. No, okay. I talk. I talk. No. I talk a lot, man. No, it's yeah, fine. No, believe me, it's fine, bro. Okay. Honestly, a pleasure, absolute pleasure. I swear to God, I really do appreciate having you on here. Yo, shout out to Big Win, ladies and gentlemen. Shout out your uh your platforms, bro. Tell people where to find you. Man, y'all can follow me on mainly all platforms because I'm really. It's really big win with three ends. Big win with three ends. Not two, not one. Three ends. Three ends. Okay? Big win. Big so, win. Yeah, follow me on all that. Boom, boom, boom. All that. Hey, again, sh send love to Saeed. I know he's not feeling that well. S show your love. Uh, oh, yeah, send love to him. Send love to him, bro. Uh, you want to sign us out? You signed us in. You might as well sign All right. Uh, <laughs> I wish I had like a director's cut thingy, like the little. Jamar, you have that joint? Yo, sign us out, huh? All right, man. Uh. One in the melanin. One in the melanin. Big win. Oh, what I'm looking at here? You're looking at this main cam, yeah. Okay, yeah. uh <coughs> tuberculosis was catching up. <laughs> One in the melanin, big win. Make sure you don't pick your scabs at night, and don't the boogeyman is watching you. God also. Hey, we love y'all. Take care. Love you guys. <laughs>